This is the story of the religious barber and a customer. One sunny afternoon, a young man named Adam walked into a barber shop for a trim. As the barber carefully styled Adam's hair, their conversation turned to matters beyond the usual small talk. Adam asked the barber, Have you ever thought about how God relates to your work as a barber? The barber paused with his scissors in hand and smiled thoughtfully. Indeed I have. You see, just as I, the barber, trim and shape hair to the best of my ability, I cannot control every aspect of how it will grow back. In a similar vein, we can strive to shape our lives and choices, but there are forces beyond our control. Adam nodded, intrigued by the analogy. So, are you saying God is like the force that determines how our hair grows back in life? Exactly, the barber replied, eyes bright with understanding. We can choose how we cut our hair, our actions and decisions, but the ultimate growth and outcome are influenced by something greater. Call it destiny, fate, or a higher power which is God and how he has designed our bodies. The barber then said, I'm sure most people would prefer to keep a hair length and style for a long time without having to trim it, but we know this isn't possible due to how God designed our hair growth process. The barber also said that this meaning is deeper for customers who have lost hair, which was beyond their control. This shows that whatever we do, our actions, our plans, and how we envision our lives, we are not solely in control of the outcome or the long-term reality. 